In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to resolve the issue when you're trying to log into your Google account, but you're greeted with the message that says couldn't find your Google account, yet the username is taken. This can be a bit tricky, but I'm here to guide you through the steps to get this sorted. First things first, it's crucial to consider a few important factors before jumping into the resolution process. Make sure to reflect on whether this account could have been deleted at some point. Remember, once a Google account is deleted, it's unfortunately not recoverable even if you see that username is taken message. This might be due to the fact that previously deleted usernames are no longer available for you to use or for anyone else to claim. Now if you're certain the account hasn't been deleted, let's proceed with the recovery process. The first action to take is to visit the Google account recovery page by going to the URL g.co recover. Once you're there, simply enter your Gmail address in the space provided. After that, click on the next button to move forward. If by any chance your account was recently deleted, Google might prompt you to enter your password. It's a necessary step to verify ownership. However, if you've forgotten your password, don't worry. You can simply select the option that says try another way. At this stage, Google will take you through a series of steps. This is where they'll attempt to confirm that you're indeed the rightful owner of the account trying to gain access. One of the methods involves two-step verification. Here, you'll be asked to confirm your identity using a phone that you've previously linked to your account. Click on the option to send a notification or code to this device. You might also need to enter your recovery phone number, so be sure to have it handy. Click on send after providing your number to get a verification code sent to your phone, then enter this code to verify your identity. If you've set up any security questions initially, you might be asked to answer these as well. Answer them as accurately as possible to help with the verification process. Once all your information checks out, Google will grant you access to create a new password. Here's a helpful tip. Choose a strong and unique password. A mix of letters, numbers and symbols is usually best. Make sure to save this password somewhere secure for future reference. And there you have it. By following these steps, you should be able to resolve this account issue and regain access to your Google account. Thanks for watching, and I hope this video has been helpful. See you next time.